phase one. Hope I've remembered everything. I'm not ready. We're off to Gatwick. North Terminal. Breakfast at Jamie's. And on to Malaga. We're going on a plane. No, not that one. Maybe next time. We're having to stand out in the cold. So much for speedy boarding. That was quick, but the weather looks grim. Bienvenidos a Malaga. Torremolinos, here we come. We're here, but it's raining. Well, we've arrived in our apartment in Torremolinos, and very nice it is too. The weather, well, that's a bit damp right now, but the forecast for the rest of the week is lovely and sunny. And it is. Welcome to Torremolinos. Well, we're in Torremolinos. We've come down to the beach today and we're heading down towards Benal Madana. The rain has stopped and it's a much nicer day than it was yesterday. And we're going to have a look at some of the storm damage that's happened over the last couple of days. There's been torrential rain and storms for the last four days. So two days ago there was a big storm here and this oil rig you see behind me broke free from its tug that was towing it into Malaga and it's now run aground just off the beach here. Oh dear. The wrecks landed just off the nudist beach. Literally. Time for lunch. Thank you very much. Sunday roast, veggie chilli, chips and rice. Back at the apartment. So I could literally reach off the balcony and pick oranges off the tree out in the street. More food. Italian pizza. I'm drinking Victoria Bitter, a local beer from Malaga. We're back in Boomerang for beer. Next day, and we're off along the coast. We're just off for a walk along the beach today towards Fuengirola. It's a beautiful day today. Ice cream time. Very nice ice cream. We're hunting for a food festival, but they've got it well hidden. We're still looking for the food festival. Well, we found it. This is Ferengi Roller International Festival. And it's busy, and there's a lot going on.
stalls from all around the world. And from just down the road. And all sorts of skills. And of course, drinks. So I found a nice craft beer here called Marengo. It's very nice red beer. There's even fresh sugar cane juice. It's quite nice. I should have had it with rum, actually. <laughs> but of course, it's not long before I find the cider. And Moroccan falafel. Well, that was the International Festival in Fuengirola. And we had some interesting things to eat and drink. Back in Pueblo Blanco, and Chris is going for the Argentinian mixed grill. I get cannelloni, although it's more like a crepe. need something to wash that down. So tonight we're having a beer in Vida, our favourite Dutch bar. How rude. Next day, and we're heading out for lunch. vegetarian restaurant that we found some years ago and they do a different menu every day with a couple of choices so we typically end up having one of everything and sharing them around and uh, so far it's very nice. Just had a lentil soup. Yum. So having had a huge meat feast yesterday I'm having a vegetarian meal today. better walk it off, starting at Plaza Maya. This must be the Guadalajara. We're just about to cross the Guadalajara River on the way to Malaga. We're walking through the bamboo woods down by the Guadalajara River. Hidden away in the river estuary is the Rio Guadalajara Nature Reserve. A series of marshy lagoons and wetlands providing refuge to over 350 species of both local and migrating birds. And other wildlife. of swallows here, looking for insects. He sells seashells on the seashore. That's Malaga in the distance. 
driftwood. Well, our walk is about to come to an abrupt halt. Well, back in September, we crossed this river and just about made it. Today, I don't think that's going to be an option. There goes our trip to Malaga. Well, alas, we've had to give up on crossing the river today. It's going to be a good couple of miles back to the road bridge. See if we can even cross there. Ooh. We head inland. We're lost. Well, against my better judgment, we've ended up on one of those pathways. Well, we made it across the motorway. I'm not sure what was safer, going across the road or if we'd have waded across the river, but we've made it this far. We're about 100 yards from where we were two hours ago, just the other side of the river inlet there. We had to hike our way back inland several miles to where a road bridge crosses over the river further up and uh, go all the way inland and back down again just to end up back here but we're here now well we finally found one of the new metro stations so we're going to see if that gets us into town well actually it totally goes to the railway station This was still being built last time we were here. It's like a tram. And after a brief stop at the railway station, we head back to Torremolinos. Dinner at Chow, which this time is located conveniently across from our apartment. Up early for a quick breakfast, and it's back to Malaga for the 10.05. We're on the way to Ronda. And it takes two hours by train. And there's only one train out a day, and one back in the afternoon. This is Ronda, and it's a long way down. I guess that's what you call a commanding view. Well, we came in on the train from Malaga. We've arrived in Ronda. Let's go around the town and have a look at some of the historic sites. We start by the bull ring. There's quite a lot of interesting things to see as we wander around the town, but really, Ronda has one main tourist attraction. Well, this is the new bridge in Ronda. It's kind of the main event in town. The new bridge, which of course isn't that new, joins the two halves of the town, which are divided by a deep gorge.
This is gorgeous. Just time for a bit of lunch. and some local culture. So that's it for Rhonda. We had a very nice afternoon here and now we're heading back on the train to Malaga. Tonight, we're heading to Codigo Bar. Welcome to Codigo. Good evening. Hey. Hello, Christian. Codigo. Hello. How are you? How are you? Yeah. Are you taking a video or what? Yeah. How are you? How are you? How are you? How are you? In the morning, Coffee at Vanilla and tea before a stroll along Carawela Beach. Oh dear, we've just walked all the way to Ben Madana to come to Wigan Bar and they've got no electricity. Oh well. We're six miles later and we've ended up back in town at Espiga for a lovely veggie feast. Then a lazy afternoon before heading down to the beach for dinner at El Gato. Wow, this is a lot for you. Now yeah, that's what I call a cocktail. Well, this is definitely the win. Cheers. It's always great in El Gato. <laughs> mm, that is a tasty burger. For our last day, we decided to climb the mountain. Today we're trying to follow the Camino del Agua, um, but the, uh, the map's very limited, it's very difficult to follow, and there doesn't seem to be many way marks, or in fact any. And there are great views over Torremolinos. We're halfway down the mountain, heading down. And that's where we end our trip this time. And that's it from Tara Milinos. Don't forget to subscribe and see you again next time. Bye bye Spain. See you again soon.